Hi there. Welcome to Baselines, episode number 42. I'm your host, Eric Baldwin. Today we're going to talk about a melodic approach to playing bass. Specifically, we're going to talk about a two-handed playing technique, which is often referred to as tapping, but more accurately described as hammer-ons and pull-offs. Whereas you may think of traditional tapping having a very percussive sound, this is going to be a more expressive and legato style of playing. Remember, the goal here isn't to learn the actual piece of music, but to learn the technique so that you can incorporate it into your own melodic playing. Let's get started, shall we? Many of you, when you think of two-handed tapping, you think of a very percussive sound. Conversely, when you think of hammer-ons and pull-offs, you might think of the legato style that you use in your left hand for doing runs, or just a more fluid left hand style of playing. Leaving your right hand free to do other things. You know, have a drink, glass of water, whatnot. The two handed style we're gonna discuss here today it's kind of a mixture in between. It's not percussive. It's more akin to the left hand style, but like the tapping style that is percussive, the articulation is going to be performed with the right hand. Let me show you. Notice that the right hand is hammering the note on the fretboard, but it's also pulling off. So all of the articulation is actually being performed with the one hand. And as you're pulling off, your left hand is setting up for the next chord position. The concept here is to attack smoothly even though you're hammering on to the fretboard. Think of it as a push. And then when you're articulating the note for the left hand, think of it as kind of a pull. It's a gentle fluid motion. It may take a little practice for you to get it to clean, but once you do, you'll find it can be very versatile. Okay, now that's using both fingers simultaneously, depressing two strings at once. Let's take a look at a little finger separation on the right hand. Notice the same push-pull action is going on with your right hand, but your two fingers are working independently of one another. But you're still basically pushing the left hand up and down the neck based on the harmonic structure that you're working with. All right, we're gonna slow it down just a little bit Zoom in so you can really see what both hands are doing in this and note how the right hand is doing all of the articulation. The same holds true when we go to the passage where we're using our two fingers independently. Well, that concludes this episode of Bass Lines. I hope you've enjoyed the presentation on a two-handed approach to melodic bass playing Take care until next time.